Hello everyone and welcome back to the next episode. We did some double drops last episode and the slowpoke well quest and today we immediately gonna continue to do that. Because for me it's the same day. Just one minute after the last episode. So <laughs> Nice, so we probably hit even a level up. Yes. We get something new. Cool, we got Ivy. So. What's there to say to Ivy? Ivy is one of the most important things to make your Pokemon stronger. The thing is, you don't need it until you reach level 60 and it rebirth your Pokemon. Why is that? So now, let's take for example HP. The maximum you could possibly get is 31 or 2. I'm actually not sure about that one of those two. Wait, maybe you can see it. Yeah, you can't. That's okay. And yeah, after rebirth, this cap increases to 47. So let's say you invest a lot of money, because it costs money, and a lot of capsules, then you do rebirth, and then you have a chance of getting higher IV, so that's why you practically, most of the time at least, don't touch them before rebirth. Maybe sometimes a bit in the early game, if you have a Pokemon you really like, and you know you're definitely gonna rebirth, then you can use at least maybe, I don't know, a couple of capsules, but um, maybe not too much. Yeah, um, they are generated randomly, which means, wait, let's take one with not so good IV, or well, he's pretty bad. So they get it like generated um, randomly. To click refresh, we need six thousand coins and one bottle and we click refresh all of the stats refresh and if you got a good stat you can lock the stat for each stat you lock the money and the bottles used increase let's say you lock all of them for every refresh, you have to pay 42,000 coins and 7 models, which is huge. So, this counts especially for people who already rebirthed their Pokemon after level 60. Do not lock something unless it is 38 or higher, at least in the beginning. Later on, if you want to have a really strong Pokemon, take your cap to 40. Don't lock before 40. What else is there to say on this page? You have here a number. Let's say you put 11. If you click refresh now, it gives you this note, which means if you click confirm, um, it just it double checks if you actually if you have um, a uh, let's say attack thirty 
13 and um, click on refresh it asks you again if you definitely sure you want to reset most important it becomes later on if you spend thousands of capsules and you go and click refresh pretty fast you want to be safe that you not skipping a good um, value so let's say on after rebirth you put 40 then you can just spam refresh and whenever you get a 40 after you click refresh you will get well that's actually a nice attack um, you will get the message if you're sure so you won't be uh, able to uh, lose a good value you, you actually want to have yeah money of course you know where to get battles you get on east treasure and the release store and later on as well on um, what is it called which is like you get it here on east treasure but the main source is on the elite four which you unlock hmm. i guess about 46 or something and yeah that's that now got some new stuff and we reach the level cap all right Yeah, now we have to defeat them. They were quite hard, if I remember right. But let's try. Come on, no boost. They only have three Pokemon. Because I guess the boss is gonna be hard. Special defense decreased. Ooh. But that was physical. That's okay. Come on, give me a boost. Come on. No. Oh yes, we got one. Oh god, thanks. Now there's, oh no, that's actually good. There's just Mark left. We do a good amount of damage. That hurts. All right, let's see how much gas to. Nice. Got that one. Ooh. Okay. Let's see, maybe we can defeat the second one as well. Looks like he has the same Pokemon as the other one. That's nice. Okay. One more. Doesn't look like it. But now we definitely have a better chance. Easy. So he probably has Mac as well. No, Eradicate. That's not too hard to beat. Easy. Now just the boss left.
let's see if we can get buff again because on this one we actually really need we actually need a buff come on come on Please now. Mm. Okay, one more chance. Come on. Tss, that hurts. No buff for me. All right. I'm gonna kind of switch. Pokemon. Perfect. Yeah, we got Eve's treasure. I love this. Thank you. So, what is there to say about this treasure? Um, you have two times a day the Espion, and two times a day, let's say, um, Umbreon. On server restart, um, there's going to be Umbreon online and let me think about it because I have wait so there's a server restart yeah okay on server restart um, every six hours they change to the other one And yeah, you have different levels, which you unlock if your character gets the specific level. So the next one we're gonna unlock at 45. And yeah, you actually, they always get harder. Okay. Um, and that's a challenge one, so you can see what I mean. They have different Pokemon. There are three guys always. The first guy has one Pokemon, the second guy has two, and the third three. Now, in total, you need to defeat all six Pokemon in 12 rounds, which you now is kind of bad because, yeah, we need to switch, which costs us a round. Oh. See if we can actually do it. 
Okay, he dies. So don't worry if you lose the Pokemon, that's totally fine. Okay, so we until now we're quite good with fire. Oh that's not bad. You can calculate you need two rounds for each Pokemon, then you're good. If you need more, then you need like at least one round with just the one hit or you lost okay six rounds left three pokemon left all right i think we can do this how much does it do not enough <laughs> but he has double edge it's himself okay let's try this this is not gonna be enough. I hope we get a one hit. Mm. I don't know if we can get that. Nope. <gasps> oh god. Well, I didn't expect that. Well, we didn't make it. We're gonna try it one more time. Because we actually... We weren't so bad. Oh, okay. Wait. Oh, we can make it. It has four times weakness against water. Oh! Nice. So, if you defeat it once, you can do uh, two times every day, you can sweep it, you don't have to fight it again. So once clear the level, you just sweep it. And Espion especially is for getting candies. Umbreon instead is for getting coins. So that's one of the most important things to do every day. Log in in the morning. Collect Umbreon. The money. It's actually one of your main resources to get coins. Those. Buy them two times. If you need more, you have to spend gems. Then after six hours, get back online. Then Espion is online. Sweep it two times and you get your candies. That's one of more or less the only way you actually get a good amount of candy because that's what you need like a big candy and sometimes these two. Those, yeah, you get them anyway, but those are the most important candies. Alright, we've done that. And we can talk to Baxi. Oh, something new again. What is it? Yeah. Something else to explain. Um, on this Rotom form, you have um, always a Legend Pokémon and a Supreme Pokémon. They change. Um, I'm actually not sure how many times a day, but it changes very often. You can go to the specific route to catch it. Let's see. Yeah. It brings us to round 30. Um, it can be in any grass. You need quite some exhaust most of the time to actually catch that Supreme. The only problem is, if anyone on your server catches it, you won't get it again. So, catch it first, or wait until the next one comes up. 
which is probably in a couple of hours. Next thing, it says here, you can find it on Route 30. The thing is, after some time, it can change the route, which means from time to time, go back on your phone, Rotom phone, and see if it changed the route. If not, you can continue in this grass you're already in. If so, change route and find another grass patch. But it can be in any, so you just have to be lucky. Nice. Oh, we don't miss a lot. Good. B Team Rocket. Didn't we just do that? Let's check it out. Or is there even more Team Rockets? Because we already defeated it, right? Or maybe we just have to talk to him. Yeah, I guess at this point there would be a level cap, which we luckily got already. Jesus Christ, there is no gameplay today, I guess. Because now we unlock the ult. The thing is though, there are a lot of guilds to explain everything. Hmm. We actually need to be in one. server we gotta find out team plasma and dark stalkers on global team plasma is the best where are dark stalkers oh. they're here they would be fine as well so to be honest Where is... where are those? Let's see. search for it no it doesn't work let's see where is team plasma There's Dark Stalkers. Gonna apply. And we can apply. On Team Plasma as well. If I find it. There it is. They do have a space. 
perfect. All right. When we are finally in the guild, I'm gonna explain that. But for now, let's finish this part with beating the gym. It is Baxi, so we'll probably lead with our stutter. There are no trainers in here. Alright. We gonna lead with him. Baxi, come at me, bro. No one hit. Oh god. I guess I'm lucky I have two fire Pokemon. <laughs> Does even oh yeah, my this is a special attacker, never mind. Wait, I'm poisoned. So my special attack is decreased. Yeah, we we'll probably need to switch. <gasps> oh my god. I can't switch now. I have to finish it. A no sword dance? I was lucky there. Yeah, and now it is the time to switch. strong hmm. okay, let's try him oh it does literally no damage I'm gonna switch that yeah, doesn't do much good mm he's -hmm. rock so we better off water What? Yes, substitute? My god. Okay, we're gonna go save on this. Oh god. We need to go save on this. Thank you. Okay, let's hit it. Death is strong. And clean mainly attacks. Struggle back. Oh god, I'm not gonna do any damage. Let's see. It is pretty low. Let's see, let's see. Okay, one more. If he uses struggle, no, he doesn't. Okay. Come on, just one more. And we're done. Got rid of that one. Let's see what's next. That's actually quite good. Don't do a lot of damage though. Probably stay in. As long as we can, because we still have another one. I missed a good. Good job, Hyperion. Okay. Nice. 
this. <gasps> I swear to God, I had never on all my three accounts and on this one and four such a good NPC. Props to you, Buck. Jesus Christ. We got a bitch. And we unlock PvP. Even more stuff for us to uh, explain. We do that when it's time for it. For now, to finish off that part. We actually gonna collect Baxi's stuff. Wait, let's use those first. Nice. Um, what I mean by that is getting into Elix Forest. Hmm, wrong one. And getting the patch locations. And yeah, we will encounter some Pokemon here and I'm gonna catch them and you will see the locations for the batch stuff. I'm gonna make that a bit faster, so at this point, I'm saying goodbye for this episode. Stay tuned for the next one, because the next one is gonna be a Gashapon opening, quite a big one. And yeah, hope you had fun, and see you next time. Peace.
Mm-hmm. <laughs>